we are going to perform DNA. Yeah. It's going to be a history, I think. Now, you guys are all together, but you didn't bring your girlfriends. Please, make one. You need a girlfriend? <laughs> no. We got are you armies. looking? We got armies. We got, like, thousands of girlfriends today in here at Microsoft in Arena, so we don't worry. No need to worry. BTS is one of the hottest boy bands at the moment and with fans across the globe, aka their BTS army, that includes many admirers. There's a lot that we know about this K-pop band from their love of food to where they call home and much more, but they have done almost too good of a job keeping their love lives under wrap. With over 20 million followers on Instagram alone and numerous record-breaking awards under their belt, the world is feeling the BTS fever. Jungkook, J-Hope, Jimin, RM, Jean, V, and Suga are all considered heartthrobs in their own right, and you already know plenty are vying for a chance with them. A question that often comes up is, do the BTS boys have girlfriends or are they dating anyone? Well, keep watching and you'll find out. If we're being real, none of the members have been in public relationships since BTS formed in 2013. So what is the deal? While being a celeb in South Korea is very different than being an A-lister in America, K-pop stars aren't supposed to date publicly, but not to worry, we've done some digging. And of course, some of the older members including Suga and J-Hope have opened up about past girlfriends too. What's going on guys? It's Kara, back at it with a new series we've titled Who Dated Who. These videos might get a little intertwined because there are some people who've hooked up with everyone. But for some reason, I don't think the BTS boys will give us any issues with that. I'm gonna go through each member of the group and see what I can tell you about who they dated. I'm also probably gonna butcher a lot of the names, so please bear with me. We recently did a dating list on the OG pop princess Britney Spears, which I'll link at the end. As we do with our other series, I need you guys to let me know who to do next in the comments down below. I'm thinking Taylor Swift because we know she dated a lot of studs or maybe like Bella Thorne. You let me know you know where and I'll see you guys after the intro. <laughs> Let's start with Junko. According to a bunch of online reports, his ideal woman is someone who's at least five foot five, but smaller than him. A good wife, a good cook, smart, has nice legs, is kind, and is good at singing. In terms of current girlfriends, he's single right now, but was rumored to be dating K-pop star Jang Ye from the group Lovelies, Jong Cheyon from DIA. <laughs> he dated cube trainee Ko Soyeon. Fans said they found an Instagram account that proved it and their nicknames Cookie and Moki continued to flood the internet. It was also said that Jungkook was talking about her in this clip. <laughs> <laughs> Not to mention before his debut, there were some other girlfriends, including a classmate by the name of Park Sewon. When this photo surfaced, it was apparently of the two kissing. She also tweeted about her boyfriend that was too busy to spend time with her when this picture came out. Jungkook is also known for his huge crush on singer IU and has even been caught fanboying during her performances. Maybe one day it'll happen. Next up is Jimin who is currently single. He admits that in the past he was victim to one-sided love when he crushed on a girl, he would blush and his heart would go crazy. Rumors have swirled around his status over the years though, the biggest one being that he was dating fellow K-pop star Han Sun Yoon from the group Kara. In fact, she got pretty candid about being into the shortest BTS member. In an interview on the show Weekly Idol, Han was asked if she had her eye on Jimin and responded. That's right, when we were promoting Mamma Mia, our promotion periods overlapped. He has caught my eye ever since. It was nice when our promotion periods overlapped by one week this time around too. But nothing seemed to happen with that. During an interview on Idol's True Colors Radio, Jimin confessed that he likes someone who is cute and has odd charms, meaning someone who's a bit silly. RM, formerly known as Rap Monster, is single and seems to be caught up in dating rumors less
less than the other BTS dudes. He's one member that did admit having a girlfriend, and in an episode of Problematic Men, he said his high school girlfriend was popular with boys and would often make him doubt himself. They broke up eventually over this. And there was a more recent rumor. In 2017, it was thought that RM had a secret girlfriend. During an interview with Billboard explaining the outro of BTS Love Yourself album, RM said, I thought it was the right outro for this album because it really is a range of emotions. I'm saying I met this person I really love. This person is the love of my life right now. I'm saying that I was confused and I was looking for love and this world is complex. There were different theories about what RM meant about this, but the most popular was that he was hiding a secret girlfriend from fans and this was in Indeed about his secret lady. I guess we'll never know. Like most of the members of BTS, Jin has also faced some dating rumors. The biggest one surrounding him has gotta be with comedian Lee Kuk Ju in 2015, especially after Jin thanked her in the first three BTS album notes. Of course, this put the army on high alert. One, two, three. People started talking when another comedian publicly joked that Lee was dating a handsome idol trainee, and even more so when it was discovered Lee and Jin were close. On top of this, Jin previously revealed that his ideal girlfriend would be on the chubby side, so then everyone really believed it. However, both Jin and Lee have insisted they are just friends. During an interview, Lee explained, So there's a person who I have been close to for over four years, and I have even cheered him on at Music Core when he debuted. BTS Jin. We are very close. He thanked me in thanks to section of his first three albums and fans put two and two together. On another note, Jean said his ideal type is someone with a puppy-like face and personality, whatever that means. Oh, and he has a crush on Anne Hathaway, which is pretty random. Next up, we got Suga, who stated he's just too busy to date. In middle school, he submitted a letter about love to a local radio host, saying he fell in love with a fellow classmate. Although they were friends, he wasn't able to tell her how he felt at first, but once he finally did, they began dating. Unfortunately, things were very awkward between the two. He admitted they didn't date long because of their problems and broke off their relationship. A rumor came up that Shugo was dating fellow K-pop star Suran after the pair worked together on the song Wine, but that was put to rest before it even really began. Not to mention, Shuga is also known for supporting LGBT rights. In a 2014 interview, he said when asked what he first notices in a girl, I focus on personality and atmosphere. I don't have an ideal type and it's not limited to a girl. Now on to V. His love life is actually the only one that BTS is management company has addressed publicly. Allegedly, V was dating a BTS fan called Hi, and this was proven by V's regular use of the phrase Hi Nuna on Instagram. When the boys management spoke about this to fans, they claimed that V and Hi were friends and in regular contact, but weren't dating. The army can't be fooled that easily though, there has been a lot more suggesting the two were an item. Hi was accused of traveling with V whenever he was scheduled overseas and dated in secret by exchanging notes on the plane. She also gifted V a ring, which he took photos wearing more than once. Aside from this, V admitted that before his BTS days, he had multiple girlfriends, but none were serious. He said, I have never been in a serious relationship. Actually, I couldn't refuse a confession. I think that's the reason why I've never been in a relationship for more than 20 days. V also says his type is someone who's kind to her parents and can help him manage his money, as well as appears cold at first, but has a warm heart. Finally, we have J-Hope. It's said he was in a relationship before BTS and that he split with his girlfriend after she moved on with someone else, but there were really not that many dating rumors about him. On an episode of Rookie King, he performed Dynamic Duo's solo because it reminded him of his past girlfriend. He reminisced about how the song played after she left him for another man. J-Hope's dream girl is someone who loves to read, takes care of others, and is good at cooking. Not to mention, she has to support him and only think about him. So after looking at the dating histories of the BTS boys, it's clear that none of them have come out with a relationship publicly since they got together. This leaves a lot to the imagination, especially for their ARMY members, which for a date. It seems less because they're busy or uninterested, but more so to protect their careers. Like I said, it's frowned upon for K-pop stars to date publicly, especially for the ones with young fans. Korean media never asks K-pop stars about their dating life, because chances are they'll say it doesn't exist. However, American interviewers are often unaware of the cultural difference and like to ask BTS about their lovers, just like when the boys went on Ellen. Is anyone here dating? Is, well, are you, uh, do you have a girlfriend? Oh, Ellen. Uh, I, I want to tell you, I really want to tell you. I think he has. <laughs> Is anyone here dating? Is, well, Are you? Uh, Is anyone here dating? Is, well, Are you? Uh, do you have a girlfriend? Oh, 
Alan. Uh, I, I want to tell you, I really want to tell you. Do you have a girlfriend? Oh. Alan. Uh, I, I want to I tell you, I really want to tell you. I think he has. Yes. <laughs> like, thanks to you, like, er, now, like, every Koreans know what the word hook up means now. Oh, yeah? Cause, yeah, because last time you asked a question. I see. Yes. Wow, that's because of me? That's wonderful. Yes, that's, right. that is wonderful. It is wonderful. <laughs> they either find creative ways to answer or just avoid it altogether. Anyways, guys, that about wraps it up for our list on who the boys from BTS have dated over the years. Although they're good at covering their tracks, the ARMY seems to be really skilled at finding things out. From rumors of some of them dating fans to other K-pop stars and everyone in between, rumors seem to be all we got to work with right now. I wonder how long it'll be until one of them actually gets into a relationship publicly. Now, of course, I wanna hear from you guys in those comments down below. Did you know about all these BTS dating stories or were there some that surprised you? I'm no expert so be sure to tell me if I missed anything too. If you like these Who Dated Who videos, let me know whose list you'd like to see next. Make sure you're subscribed and follow me on Instagram if you want to chat more. I'll see you next time with some new videos. Bye!